Lower extremity venous insufficiency is very common among people, affecting 30% of males and 65% of females. Fortunately, the innovation of ultrasound has improved the diagnosis of the disease because varicose veins aren't just a cosmetic issue, but can cause pain, swelling, heaviness, itching, bleeding, and ulcers. Valvular incompetence in the veins causes a buildup of pressure of the blood in the leg, leading to venous hypertension. This may result in painful varicose veins. Fortunately, it's something that can be found and treated by Dr. Fitzgibbons. The average varicose vein patient would need endovenous ablation. This is a 20 30 minute procedure done to an outpatient in the office with local anesthesia. He inserts a catheter, then snakes a laser fiber up through the catheter into the vein. Dr. Fitzgibbons has done over 2,000 ablations in eight years, and only three patients have decided not to continue treatment after the first ablation. This is a minimally invasive procedure that is done in the doctor's office under local anesthetic. Endovenous ablation uses a laser to get rid of varicose veins, and you will walk out of the doctor's office after surgery and will be encouraged to return to normal daily activities as soon as possible. Sclerotherapy means placing a small needle into a vein and injecting a chemical which then destroys the vein and makes it disappear. Complementary sclerotherapy will eliminate visible varicose veins.